What's going on with a YouTube? It's your boy 345 German. In today's video, we're going to be giving y'all a video on why I chose to get the Dodge Challenger RT. So, y'all probably like Germ. Why you go Charlie? Why you ain't go Charger instead? You know what I'm saying? Like, why did you get the RT? Why did you get the 5.7? Why didn't you go Scat? Why didn't you go Cat? You know what I'm saying? So, we're going to be letting y'all know in this video why I chose to go with a Dodge Challenge RT, man. So make sure y'all boys stick it to the end and we're gonna get y'all in this video, man. This is a 2016 Dodge Challenger, y'all. And when I got it, y'all, I only had got it with 35,000 miles on it, y'all. So if y'all do not know, a 2016 with 35K miles on it, and then for it to be one of these, that was real low, y'all. So, you know what I'm saying? When I was comparing it to the other, uh cars i was trying to get and shit i was comparing the mileage the years and stuff like that and this one had the lowest out of all of them y'all so when i got this this only had 35k on it y'all so that's uh that's one of the reasons why i chose to get the dodge challenger rt that i got right now the mrt or the three four pharma build type shit and yeah man like i said who would go wrong with 35k miles the lowest amount of miles that you can get for 2016 you know what i'm saying and the good buddy style and shit like that like mines and shit like that so Number two, I chose to get the Dodge Challenger RT, y'all, was because I still got that power and I still got the V8 Grumble, y'all. So even though I didn't get me a Scat or even though I didn't get me a Hellcat or anything like that, y'all, I still got me a V8. I still got the Grumble. My car is still loud and it still got a decent amount of power and torque on it that where it can direct me and shit like What do you mean by that? That. So I really um, got it because of that and shit, you know what I'm saying? I didn't mind with getting the, uh, the RT and shit like that because it's still a V8, like I said, y'all. And I needed something just to start off with y'all. And too, but I was really looking for more parts and stuff when I was in the market, though. So I didn't mind getting a Charlie because it had low miles and it had the V8 grumble and it was loud and stuff like that, y'all. So on the reason number three. Reason number three, I chose to get the Dodge Challenger RT was because y'all. When I was in the market for Chargers, y'all, I was looking for a, a Daytona, y'all. So I was trying to look for RT Daytona. But before I was looking for RT Daytonas, I was going for Scats. So I was going for Scats first. But I, um, I was looking around and shit like that. And I was getting quotes and shit for like 500 a month. And the note was about like 800. So that was about like a good 1300 on a Scat. Not including the maintenance for it and not including the gas for it. And y'all, I was not going. So I'm like, no, nah, let me just step it down the trim. So I'm going to go ahead and go to the RT trim. But when I was still looking for charges, y'all, all the charges in the market is still gonna be higher than the Chalice, only because everybody chose the charger and the four doors over the two doors, y'all. So that's another reason why I went to Chalice, y'all, because the market on the Chalice is way lower than it is on the chargers. So um, this one was a, at a way affordable price than it was to get you a charger RT, y'all. Char, reason number four on why I chose to go with the Dodge Challenger RT, man. It's because of my body style, y'all. So, as y'all can see, my Challenger RT already looks nice as it is. It looked like a scat pack, but it's not, you know what I'm saying? But it looked better than most RT trims. And this one pretty much like a TA trim, if that makes sense. Because I got the 50th edition seat. So, these pretty much like the TAs, if that makes sense, for Chalice. And mine came with some. So, yeah, I got it on both sides. You know, carbon fiber accent, stuff like that, y'all. You know, nothing too crazy for real, for real. So you got a back seat. But yeah, man, because my RT style, well, the RCLT style that it comes and shit like that, y'all, as y'all can see, it look better than most Chelly RTs that you would get off the market from a dealership. If y'all know what I'm trying to say, they don't come like this from a dealership, if that makes sense for real, for real y'all. So I got lucky with uh, getting mines and shit like that. So that's reason number four. And we're going to get y'all on reason number five. On why I chose to go with the Dodge Challenger RT, y'all. Hey, trying the last reason on why I chose to go with the Dodge Challenger RT, y'all, was because of the mods and stuff that I can do to it, y'all. And then as well as I needed to build a name for myself for the YouTube, y'all. So, as y'all know, I did just start YouTube not so long ago, about like a cool eight months, so not even a year. But I needed something to start off with, y'all. You know what I'm saying? Like I was saying, I didn't have no mobile at all. So 
I needed something to start off with, and this was probably like the best looking project that I can work on and shit like that. But as I can see though, like you can do a lot to tell your RTs, man. Just based off of how it came, looking from dealership wise and shit like that, y'all. So, you know, you can throw the rear diffuser, worker bill, uh, scat pack lip, scat pack hood, front bumper, wide body kit, lower it, you know, Brembo upgrade, rotor upgrade. You know, you can do a lot of little stuff to a stars, shit like that and shit. So I'm like, you know what? The RT is a little bit more affordable and shit like that, so why not try to start off with that one? Because it got some parlor and shit that I can work with, and then it's way more in my price range and shit than what the scat pack was and shit, y'all. So that was pretty much like the last reason. And I'm gonna end the video off right here, man. I hope y'all boys enjoyed this video, and we're gonna catch y'all boys in the next video, man. Make sure y'all like, comment, share, subscribe, and we out of here. Look at my rack solid. I see the grass getting long. Snakes, I'm gon' mow it. I'm gon' blow like brown. Racks on me, I'm sorry. Talk here, top of the morning. I'm in the car, got motion. Bib ain't wrong, can't fall.